Hi everyone. So, um, totally bittersweet moment. I took a moment to walk around my yard and I had strawberry runners going crazy this week. And with the baby, it's a little hard to get to everything. And I knew this of course going in, so I didn't plant a big garden this year, but there's perennials and there's perennial fruit. So I have this grapevine that is three different varieties and within a week, this further end down here has dropped most of its grapes. It got so hot this week. It was in the 90s. So um, they were done and I didn't think they were quite done, but I had taste tested them last week and I let them go a little bit further because I just didn't have the time to get to it. And you can see it's a lot thinner behind me and the leaves are discolored. So usually these dark purple ones, which are awesome, awesome. And these were planted before we got here, so we don't know exactly what they all are. But I had um, a deep purple grape, which probably was Concord grape. And then we had white grapes in the center that was a little sweeter. And then down here at the opposite end, I have more of a reddish grape. Um, I am harvesting what I can of what is left because we need jam. Uh, my kids love uh, fresh grape jam and jelly. I did grape juice last year and I still have some of that, but I want to save that for drinking. Um, there are different things they learned about it. So if I do make some more grape juice, I would want to make it a little bit stronger, a little more concentrated. I was worried about having it too concentrated. So this time I am going to boil these down and um, get them processed right away into jelly. So super fun weekend for me because I hadn't really planned on doing it. It's late um, on Saturday. So I am... It was so warm today so so warm so the sun is going down and it's probably only about 80 now i'm still hot <laughs> bethany's off watering the rest of the strawberry plants but just look here this is my raspberry and blackberry patch that you've seen in the past these are the rat the blackberries in the back row and they're all first year canes and some of them second year canes so i'm not really getting any blackberries this year and i'm only getting a few of the raspberries because really they're getting choked out. Um, I have mulched this in the past with oat hay and a lot of it took the seed. <laughs> so I really, really do do, um, I've been doing weed whacking in between because I've been getting burdock growing down here on the ground. Um, I don't want that to go to seed and some of it already has um, heads on it but they haven't dried out to seed yet so I need to come out here again. I've just been weed whacking it down and I have first year raspberry plants growing like crazy. I wish, wish, wish I had a greenhouse um, to be able to transplant as much as I can. Um, but there's only so much that you need. So if you need any raspberry plants, let me know. Um, so I'm going to get to clipping off some more of the grapes. But just look at these beautiful, beautiful grapes on, on the vines here. And they're growing right on the ground. <laughs> I have tied up what I could. But those runners just really take off. Um, and I've been trying to train them to wires. Last year I put in some more T-posts. Um, these were 8 foot tall T-posts. And I need to, to run some more wire and string to get them trellised up off the ground. Um, one of my neighbors has a beautiful trellising of hers. And it's just a solid wall. Um, it's almost like a privacy fence between her and the neighbors. So um, obviously I don't need to privacy fence this from anything. What? Oh, well, I don't have any blueberries to pick. They're all, Daddy hadn't been mowing around them. Daddy was afraid that he was going to hit them. <laughs> so he left it, and I have mare's tail growing in here like crazy. So I'm going to have to go through the weed whacker and rediscover my blueberry plants and mulch the heck out of this area. So anyways, that's my grapes. Oh, I am. I'm picking grapes. What do you think about that, Miss Bethy? It's awesome. Yes, we're going to make grape jelly for hey, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I want some. Okay, but they have seeds in them. Yes. The first clue that gave me that I had to get over here and pick them is hornets have been popping up everywhere. Yeah, yum, yum, yum. The apples are falling off the tree because it's so hot. It's too early um, to harvest all this stuff from previous years. Oh, you found the seed, don't you? And the skins are really tough. 
Yeah, they're not like grapes from the store. Yeah, we have to cook these grapes. A little puckery? Mm-mm. Mm-mm, you like it? You're all wet. You know that? You got all wet. Are you watering all the strawberries for us? Oh, thank you so much. Thanks. You're a good garden helper. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, tell everybody bye. We'll see you next time. Bye.